Good morning, everybody. Welcome back to the video. Um, we today I'm vlogging my day, and we're going to Henley's or Hardley's. I don't know where. It's like a crocodile farm. So yeah, I'll vlog that today. And I think we're going like on a boat. Oh my god, I'm stuck in this. And I think today we're going on a boat to see like to see like all the crocodiles and stuff. But yeah, like you know, there's like tours where you go through the river and you see them. We're going on that today. So I'll see you guys soon, and I'll see. You, I don't know. Just arrived at Hardley's. Hardley's is not Hardley's. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I nearly fell down that ditch there, guys. <laughs> I don't know why I'm laughing at that. There it is. <coughs> you know, I remember Aiden looks like um Andrew. Andrew of Toy Story. Andy, not Toy Story. So you got this tattoos. Just gonna zoom in on there. Anyways, I'll see you guys when we get into Hardy's. Something stinks. So yeah, here's the. Oh yeah, why do we not park here? Overflow park. <laughs> so there's the entry to Hardy's. Look at that hill though. That hill looks very really nice. Hey you guys. Welcome to Hardy's. Okay. How are you feeling, Ryan? Excited. Yeah. How are you feeling? Well, Ryan's nickname is actually Croc, I'm pretty sure. Oh, we got the big Croc here. Guys, there's a crocodile. Are the Crocs are like one of my favourite animals. Oh, we're going to have to line up for hours. That's where I'll be parking oh, my future car. My Tesla. God. Who's, ex who's been here before? Oh. Me. I haven't. I haven't. Me. So. Limited mobile coverage. Mm. Limited mobile coverage. My tattoo looks better. Like, oh. <laughs> it says you must enter at your own risk. That's not a good sign. Where? Sky's taking over the vlog today. Make sure it doesn't fall out. Where? Over here. Give me. See it? I don't see any fish. What is there? Guys, there's a croc. There's a crocodile croc. There's a croc. No, look, there's a croc. There's... Oh, I've got it! <laughs> <laughs> Today, I'm going to be um, trying crocodile for the first time. Like, I'm actually going to be eating it. Where's the croc? Oh, they Later on, guys, you're going to see us go in this river the on a boat. Who's person like... Feeds it. And do we sit on the oh boat no, while the crocodiles? Get, we're gonna get oh, eaten. Oh, my God, got eaten. It's gonna eat the bird. That'd be kind of funny, though. <laughs> what? I'm not walking under that. Wait, like we haven't seen koalas before. It's kind of cute. I kind of like it. Cute. Why is it not flying away? Sky, you just got rid of your chlamydia. Now you're gonna get it back. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> they told me to film, but <gasps> holy shit! Holy shit! That's real. That's a real clock. Wait, is it? No, that's fake. Look at this guy. Hi, Gregory. He's not going to go. I know I need to check. Ryan just tipped water on the crocodile. It's one of the closest I've ever been to a crocodile. Same. I've pat like an alligator before, though. A few minutes later. Yeah, thank you. Make sure you can see the crop. Thank you. Thanks very much. Look at this guy. Oh. Look how cute this guy is. They're big animals. Small. They're very lazy animals. Yeah. So here's the alligator. Very similar though, aren't they? Mm. Isn't it funny how they just... I want it. Hi. Hello. There's a turtle in there. Oh, a lizard. He's so cute. Turtle. See that rock? Is it looks like mesh. It's probably warm. Look at this cutie. Just swimming. 
when something goes wrong, I'm aware these are all sick, that's what it is, it's all bloodthirsty crowds, it's alright, yeah. hopefully you don't get what you want, anyway, welcome to the 12.30 show, this is an extra show we do, oh mate, we'll get to that, alright, I think he's there, anyone seen him before, he stayed there, you reckon, let's test that theory, Sitting in the water, bro. Get out. Oh, yeah. That's enough. I'll talk about him. In... Where is he? Oh. And you're hiding an almost four meter crocodile. So he is. He's 3.8 meters, which is. And now there's a couple more. And I'll mm -hmm. this um, thing. What do they mainly eat in the wild? What? Mate, they're known as obligate, indiscriminate carnivores. So it would all depend on where they are. And they are. They're, their distribution's very wide. They're not just found here in Australia, right through the Indo-Pacific up to Southern India. Yeah. So depending on where they're living, it's yeah. going to depend on what their main food source is. Yeah. But they done a stomach content check on one in the Northern That's Territory. It had a freshwater turtle, parts oh. of a wallaby, barramundi, and I think mudcrabs as well, all in its guts. It was a non-lethal stomach content check that they done. Yeah. So they're not That's interesting. They're hitting all the food groups that they can. Yeah. <laughs> one so Lunch and we're lining up to get on the boat, the crocodile cruise. So I'll see you guys when we're on that. Boarding the crocodile cruise up. Um, yep. How many more have you got? Can we look at eight of us? Nice. 36, 37, 38, 39, 30, 31. Imagine if I got cut off. Imagine if I got cut off. That would be so much. No, it's all right. I, I felt bad. They do whatever you want to do with counting. I'd be spilling. <laughs> yeah, you're the They packed the banks. They removed all the invasive species of plants out of here, replaced them with native ones, filled it up full of water, fish, and crocodiles, and hoped for the best. But luckily, for different reasons, they play a very important role in flood mitigation because they hold all the water, stop it from running elsewhere. The other thing that they do is provide suitable habitat for hundreds of species of plants and animals. Wetlands are some of the most biodiverse uh, environments on the planet. Now out here we don't just have the crocodiles, we also have 16 species of freshwater fish, things like barramundi, tarpon, mangrove jack. There's been about eight of the birds dropped them while they jumped up through the spillway, uh, and all the birds came around by themselves as well. They're probably still, if we were to just walk away today and leave it alone, they'll probably all be fine. 
that can feed off the fish, they can feed off the bird in half metres in length. We do have one big sucker out here. His name's Paul. He's 6.7, sorry, 4.7 metres, weighs about 600 kilograms. So back in the 1980s, Paul was cruising around up in Cooktown eating cows. He's a really cool animal. They didn't want him dead, they just wanted him to stop eating the cows. So rather than shoot him, which is what most other people would have done back then, they contracted someone to come and catch him and he got a swift ticket to Harvest Crocodile Adventures. And just a little bit of a reference of size for Paul. If he was touching my boots with his snout, his tail would be over the end of the boat. Wow. He's absolutely massive. Now there's a good chance we're not going to see him from the boat today, guys. Um, one, he's scared of they get their energy from food the same way that we do. The only difference is they have their body has to be at an optimum temperature to digest it. Now what I'm going to do is actually just move out here a little bit because I don't like where the uh, back of the boat is in comparison to the land. And then we might try and get him to come over because he does look a little bit keen. <laughs> this guy here, his name's Newby, the newest male in the lagoon. That's the one on the left there. Now he does look like he wants some, so I am going to... This is Little Boy, he's the second largest male in the lagoon. This is the one that you saw leave the boat ramp before. Did you just see my reflection? Oh! oh. <laughs> Can I have that back, please? Nope. Oh, no. Oh, oh, well, you saw him. There you go. Okay, guys, so we're just leaving Hartley's now. Is it called Hartley's? Hartley's. Hartley's. We're leaving Hartley's now. And we're going to go back to the motel and have a swim. And I'm going to have to edit. Ow! That's where your car will be going. Yep, my Tesla. And I'm going to edit some of this video, then go back and have a swim. Wet Willy! <laughs> <laughs> How do you feel about that? Feet up, it's through at a roundabout. Wait, what? what? Rail crossing. How's your ear? How's your ear, bro? Okay guys, hope you guys enjoyed this video of the Crocodile Park. Um, we're just going around the pool right now. I'll show you a video of the pool maybe. I don't know if I feel like it. But um, yeah, see you guys in the next vlog. I don't know what the next vlog will be. If I'll be in Cairns or back at home. <coughs> oh, I have a cough though. But anyway guys, I'll see you guys in the next video. Have a lovely day or night. Bye!